Confidence can be a powerful force in our lives, provided that we place our confidence in the right things. With all that life's throwing at you right now, let me ask you, how confident are you? Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond and welcome again to Fresh. If you believe in Jesus, I'm guessing that at some point, perhaps early on when you accepted him into your life, you had a great zeal, a great confidence in him. You were looking forward to the journey. But then, little by little, the realities of life sank in. The daily pressure of just making it through began to chip away at the confidence you once had. In short, your faith waned. Am I right? The good news is that there's nothing new in any of that. You're not alone. And today, by His Spirit and His Word, I believe that God is going to breathe His confidence back into your heart, that He'll give you all that you need. Are you ready? But recall those earlier days when, after you'd been enlightened, you endured a hard struggle with suffering, sometimes being publicly exposed to abuse and persecution, and sometimes being partners with those so treated. For you had compassion for those who were in prison, and you cheerfully accepted the plundering of your possessions, knowing that you yourselves possessed something better and more lasting. Do not therefore abandon that confidence of yours. It brings a great reward. For you need endurance, so that when you've done the will of God, you may receive what was promised. By the power of the Holy Spirit, I say to you, do not abandon that confidence of yours, for it brings a great reward. That's God's word fresh for you today. <music>